Right, so for the purposes of the film, let's look at this on larger paper. So, here's a question. A hundred and twenty four times a hundred and thirty two. But normally that's the kind of question that you'd immediately reach for your calculator for. You wouldn't want to do it. You think that's gonna have lots of lines of working. You have to add them all together, and it's gonna take a lot of time. Much easier to do it on a calculator. But what I'm gonna show you is how to put the answer in one line and just work through, put the answer in one line and no working. Oh, much better. Okay. So to start off, as before, you do the first column, 4 times 2 is 8. Okay. Yep. Then increase the size of the box and put a cross. So we do 2 times 2 and 4 times 3. So 4 times 3 is 12, 2 times 2 is 4, altogether 16. So you put 6 and carry 1. So we always write down one number first and then always write down one number and then put the carry the one. Once we've done that, increase the size of the box again. And this time draw a Union Jack, a bit like that. And work across. One times four is four. One times two is two. So that's six so far. Then two times three is six plus the one makes all together 13, so 3, and again, carry the 1. Now you move left and have a box to the left here, and again, draw a cross. 1 times 3 is 3, 2 times 1 is 2, that's 5, plus 1 is 6. And then finally, do the final column, 1 times 1 is 1. So our answer in one line is 16,368. So we don't need a calculator. We don't That's need right. a calculator anymore. Mm. So the column just moves to the left each time. Yeah, that's right. We just start on the right and work over to the left. Oh, much better. Okay, yeah. good. Much quicker than doing it in the old way, school way. Yeah, the old school way is understandable, but this is, comes from what I call algebraic arithmetic. If you uh, study some algebra and you work with it a bit, you can realise that actually you can make arithmetic a lot simpler. Yeah. And that's what I've done there. Just do the addition as you're going along instead of that's doing right. it all afterwards. Yeah, that's the idea. And in yeah. fact, that's, that is the order we do things. If you're multiplying out algebra, that is the order we do it in. So I've just mm. applied that to numbers once it comes out in one. Okay. Is that okay? Yep. So do you want to try that now? Okay. So what you can try is... 124 times 241. Do you want to try that on there? Yep. Okay, so it's 124 times 241. Um, so you do the right hand side, 4 times 1 is 4, and then um, so 2 times 1 is 1, and 4 times 4 is 16, so that's... What's 2 times 1? 2. 2, right. And 4 times 4 is 16, so mm -hmm. add them together, it's 18. Right, so 8 carry 1, good. Yep. Um, and then move the box over again, and you have your Union Jack situation. Uh, 4 times 2 is 8, um, and then 2 times 4 is also 8, and then 1 times 1 is 1. So that's 17 plus the 1 that we carried is 18. Good. And then move it back over. So we've just got the last two columns. Now the cross, 1 times 4 is 4, and 2 times 2 is also 4, so that's 8 plus the 1 is 9. Great. And then the last column, 2 times 1 is 2. So 29,884. Right, perfect.